No, pardon me, Sven. Where's Angier? Hello? Angier! Kneeling or praying at something. And gear. Hey, where are you? Let me talk to you about something important. Now where are these guys? Oh, there we go. What's up, fellas? Sky. Sky above, voice within. And hello to you too. I need to learn the shout to use to defeat Alduin. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? Was it matter? Yes. For matters of such gravity, we need to know where you stand, or who you stand with. I have nothing to hide. The blades helped me find out about it. The blades, of course. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their reckless arrogance knows no bounds. They have always sought to turn the Dragonborn from the path of wisdom. Have you learned nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the blades to be used for their own purposes? Look, Engar. The Blades just want to defeat Alduin, don't you? What I want is irrelevant. This shout was used once before, was it not? And here we are again. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Those who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end, so be it. What? Let it end and be reborn. So you won't help me? No, not now. Not until you return to the path of wisdom. Intemperate. I allowed my emotions to cloud my judgment. Master Einarth reminded me of my duty. The decision whether or not to help you is not mine to make. So can you teach me this shout? No. I cannot teach it to you because I do not know it. It is called Dragonrend, but its words of power are unknown to us. We do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. What's so bad about Dragonland? Dragonrend. It was created by those who had lived under the unimaginable cruelty of Alduin's dragon cult. Their whole lives were consumed with hatred for dragons, and they poured all their anger and hatred into this shout. When you learn a shout, you take it into your very being. In a sense, you become the shout. In order to learn and use this shout, you will be taking this evil into yourself. If the shout is lost, how can I defeat Alduin? Only Parthenax, the master of our order, can answer that question, if he so chooses. I need to speak to Parthenax then. You weren't ready, you still aren't ready. But, thanks to the Blades, you now have questions that only Parthenax can answer. Why haven't I met Parthenax yet? He lives in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. He speaks to us only rarely, and never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him is a great privilege. 
How do I get to the top of the mountain to see him? Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Can I help you? Alright guys, I'm gonna need you guys to stay here. to Parthenax lies through this gate. I will show you how to open the way. my understanding of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. Clear skies will blow away the mist, but only for a time. The path to Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal, and you will reach the summit. <sighs> All right, Angier, thank you. Use clear skies to open the way to Parthenon.
what are those things? They're cold. Hold up here. It's more of that weird freaky wind. Parthenax? Who are you? What brings you to my Strunmach, my mountain? You're the master of the Greybeards? They see me as master. Wuth Onik, old and wise. It is true I am old. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? I need to learn the Dragon Wren shout. Can you teach me? Hmm. Drem. Patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my Thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dovahkiin. Dover. 
Why do you delay? Are you Dover Keen or not? <laughs> ah, yes. Sosedo Vlostmul. The dragon blood runs strong in you. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. Oh, your own kinds are coming back, aren't they? So, you have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova Sauce, Dragon Blood. What would you ask of me? Can you teach me the Dragon Ren shout? Ah. I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Timvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. Yes. The Greybeards didn't want me to come at all. Mm, yes. They are very protective of me, Bahlan Fadon. But I do not know the Thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. Your kind, Jaw, mortals, created it as a weapon against the Dove, the dragons. Our Hadrime, our minds cannot even comprehend its concepts. How can I learn it then? Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this doom? I like this world. I don't want it to end. Prusa has good a reason as any. There are many who feel as you do, although not all. Some would say that all things must end so that the next can come to pass. Perhaps this world is simply the egg of the next Kalpa, Lean Vokin? Would you stop the next world from being born? The next world will have to take care of itself. Pause. A fair answer. Rofus, maybe you only balance the forces that work to quicken the end of this world. Even we who ride the currents of time cannot see past time's end. Wulsetid los trahodis. Those who try to hasten the end may delay it. Those who work to delay the end may bring it closer. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus. Now, I will answer your question. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monaven, what you name Throat of the World? Nice views. No, dragons like mountains, right? True, but few now remember that this was the very spot where Alduin was defeated by the ancient tongues. Varucht Unslad. Perhaps none but me now remember how he was defeated. Using the dragon shout, right? Hmm. Yes and no. Viknuzni Karon. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. 
The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin, but this was not enough. Ok Mulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. What? Are you saying that ancient Norns sent Alduin forward in time? Not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. Maye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day, he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. What is an Elder Scroll? Hmm, how to explain in your tongue? The Dove have words for such things that Jaw do not. It is an artifact from outside time. It does not exist, but it has always existed. Rahwatlan, they are mm, fragments of creation. The Kelly. Elder Scrolls, as you name them, they have often been used for prophecy. Yes, your prophecy comes from an Elder Scroll. But this is only a small part of their power. So far, Suyek. Jeez. How does any of this help me? Tid Krent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the Tid Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to... Cast yourself back to the other end of the break. Go. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. Go back in time? Do you know where I can find an Elder Scroll? Krosis, no. I know little of what has passed below in the long years I have lived here. You are likely better informed than I. That's Werner Angier might have some idea. Trust your instincts, Dovahkiin. Your blood will show you the way. What do I do with the Elder Scroll when I find it? Return it here to the Tid Ahran. Then, Kele Vomindok. Nothing is certain with such things. But I believe the scroll's bond with the Teed Ahran will allow you a... a seeing, a vision of the moment of its creation. Then you will feel no dragon wren in the power of its first expression. You will see them, Wuthfadon, my friends, Haken, Gormleith, Feldir. Harkin, Gormleith, Feldir, who are they? The first mortals that I taught the Thum, the first tongues, the leaders of the rebellion against Alduin. They were mighty in their day, even to attempt to defeat Alduin. 
Sahrotchun. The Nords have had many heroes since, but none greater. Thank you. Drem your look. Greetings. How could an Elder Scroll cast Elden through time? Vormendark, I do not know. Perhaps in the very doing, they erased the knowing of it from time itself. The Dove are children of Akatosh. Thus, we are specially attuned to the flow of time. Perhaps also uniquely vulnerable. I warned them against such a rash action. Even I could not foresee its consequences. Nust Lihon, they would not listen. You mean you were there? Yes. There were a few of us that rebelled against Alduin Thur, his tyranny. We aided the humans in his overthrow. But they did not trust us, ni of. Their inner counsels were kept hidden from us. I was far from here on the day of Alduin's downfall, but all Dove felt the sundering of time itself. What does the Dragon Ranch shout actually do? I cannot tell you in detail. I never heard it used. Kogan. It was the first Thum created solely by mortals. It was said to force a dragon to experience the concept of mortality. A truly von Mindoran. Incomprehensible idea to the immortal Dove. Alright. Look, Thum. See you, Parthenax. I need the Elder Scroll, the ancient used. Do you know where I can find it? We ever concerned ourselves with the scrolls. The gods themselves would rightly fear to tamper with such things. As for where to find it, such blasphemies have always been the stock and trade of the mages of Winterhold. They may be able to tell you something about the Elder Scroll you seek. Winterhold, huh? Is there another way to defeat Elduin? Perhaps not. But this shout was used once before, was it not? And here we are again. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Those who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end, so be it. Let it end and be reborn. All right, thanks, Angear, for all that you've done for me. Sky above, voice within. All right, guys. Yes? Let's roll out. Yes? Before we go to Winterhold, I want to talk to Esbert. All right, let's go. I'm still here. 